99 cent worth pepperoni and cheese. Got a GMC. We need a transfer case. I want 200. I'll just buy a whole truck for 100. Complete truck. Celebrate. What do you got here? That's how you do it. That's how you do it right now. A couple Delmonico's. Turned out to be a nice Sunday. When you don't look under the hood and you just assume something, you uh, don't make out so good. On the old Facebook marketplace, Sunday morning again, this uh, ad for this was only 20 minutes old. It's an 03 GMC Sierra. Kid said I want it out of here. It's got a lot of rot. But I was only concerned about one thing. Oh yeah. It's got the old manual T case. Just like I need for that truck. So, oh. transfer cases, uh, as I already said, it's 200 from the junkyard. He had to take a ride. So I offered him $100 for the whole truck. He said, come get it. It said, uh, it said in the ad it was a 5.3 V8. So I said, man, can't go wrong here. I mean, parts all over the place. The uh, starter just went in the 01, so uh, she's sitting there on ice, pushed her right up. Starter just completely said, no way, all done. So uh, the bed was off. Yeah, I was sitting in the yard, but uh, we hucked it back on there. And uh, she's just, uh, she's total junk. What happens up here in Maine? Oh yeah, hit my knee right on that. It's nice. Oof. Oh yeah, she's rotten. Even threw the old shitty tailgate in. Oh, what's this? What's this? Oh, oh, still cold. Oh. Ah. He also had this, uh, this rack that was on there. Got a little bit of rot towards the back, but not too bad. Eight foot bed, little rack there. You can cut that off and just use a back rack or something. Put that on the old marketplace if somebody wants it. <laughs> What? I said, you know what? I'm not even going to look under the hood at this thing. When I got there, just winched it up. Then when I got home, I said, son of a 4.3, yep, stupid, stupid 
noisy, noisy Cummins. But uh, yeah, it doesn't even run. Nope. They have uh, they've snipped a bunch of fuel lines under there, all in the frame rail and up near the filter and everything. And as you can see, I jacked up the trailer and uh, slid under there. Just see if I could uh, at least get it running. I can move it around because uh, it does have the one piece that I need, that transfer case. That is going to work, even though I can't even test it out, but I'm just going to gamble it. So, I figured I could get it running, that way I can move it around and get it in the garage and strip it and everything. If it was a V8, I would have kept everything taking that right out but you know still not a bad deal it's got both cats on it and uh got some rather decent tires on it not too bad still got some tread left a few parts the starter is not even the same so i can't even use the starter and slap it in this get it going so there you go Hundred bucks, can't go wrong. Pretty nice Sunday. Got the old Mongoose, 1984 model. Shined her up a little bit. Fellow YouTuber gave me some info, told me what to do. So uh, she's on eBay, and. Uh, Bids are rolling in already. So we'll see what happens. Oh, the old Westinghouse. Yeah. Real rattly son of a bitch. Still works though. Oh, the wife said, uh, list this rocking chair on uh, Marketplace. Sell that. I don't want it. I was like, okay. Hmm. Brought it out to the garage. and uh, <laughs> Not a bad fit. 